Hello and welcome to Mill Creek TV. I'm Ann Murphy and today we're going to talk about a very popular home improvement, granite countertops. The number one choice nationwide and by far in countertops is granite. By adding this beautiful material to your home, you immediately add both real value and beauty like nothing else. Mill Creek has one of the largest selections of granite in Oklahoma. And we have our own in-house fabrication facility and installation department here to serve you. The process starts by visiting with one of our showroom consultants and deciding just what you want. Then we schedule a complimentary measure to determine the scope of your project. In this video, we hope you will learn a little bit about what to expect in changing out your countertops to granite. For example, the need to select your own licensed plumber to install your sink. Once your budget is established, we will help you navigate through the entire process, from sink and corbel selection, tearing out your old countertop, to granite fabrication and installation, including the templating process. Later on, we'll go out and meet one of our customers who just completed a granite installation. Now here's Joe Kramer, with Mill Creek Granite, who is templating our customer's countertop for granite. Templating is one of the most important steps in putting in a granite kitchen because if it doesn't fit, then you basically start all over. Right, right now we've got all these, these two and a quarter inch birch strips laid out, which is the perimeter of the wall, so we can find if it's out of square or, or if it is square. So we're following anything to, to be precise when we bring the granite in. The front side is going to figure our overhang for us so we're consistent off the front of the cabinet. And we're, we're just basically making sure that we're creating a, a, a mock countertop right now so that when we take it back to the shop and fabricate it, it will end up the same exact size as what we got here in these, in these boards. It, it creates a, a real precise fit. You've only got about an eighth to a quarter of an inch play, usually. so. Uh, we want to get it about as good as we can get it. You know, every job we do is basically custom. Whether it's a square cabinet look or not, we have to make sure it, it follows what is provided. We take a lot of pride in our work. I mean, we, we pay a lot of attention to a lot of detail and, uh, and getting precise fits and matching colors. You know, there's a lot of details when it comes to countertops, not just carrying in rock. It's matching colors and grain and vein and flow and when you put them together, make it look like it was still one solid piece of rock. We stock our own slabs. We have our own design area. And uh, we basically do it all from, from templating to fabrication, to installation, everything. As you can see, Joe Kramer really knows his business. I'm here at the home of Stephen Valerie, and I'm going to introduce you to them in just a minute. But first, let's go back to Joe as he explains the installation process for this very kitchen. Now what we've done, we've come in and checked all the level of the countertops to make sure everything's ready for us within industry standard, which is a quarter of an inch. And we've carried all the rock in, set it in place. Next step's going to be leveling it. Make sure everything's going to run level. Make sure your seams are tight. Make sure everything fits as far as your stove, uh, any appliances that go in it. Then we're going to mount your sink and drill holes and do some seams. Basically what we do is we, we level the main section and then we're going to put these bars on each side of it to draw the, the stone together and make sure they're all running the same level. We have two different ways of gluing. We're going to use some cardboard tabs. We'll spread the glue on here and then we'll go up underneath and that right there will go Part of it will be on the rock and part will be on the cabinet so it just actually sets it to the cabinet. That way there's no chance of it moving. What we're doing here is we're coloring the, the epoxy over here and we're trying it out. We're putting it in here and make sure it's going to be close enough color and then we're going to, if we need to adjust it some more, we add some more color here and there and then make sure it's going to, going to match the stone. Once we're all completely done, we're going to give it a good cleaning and then we're going to seal it with a uh, granite sealer, a stone sealer. We'll use an impregnator and it's going to close off all the pores since granite's a porous stone. We're going to make sure nothing can penetra penetrate the stone or, or, or stain it. We recommend you do it once a year 
and uh, once it's done, it's, it's good to go. This job turned out just beautiful. So a big thanks to Joe and the whole crew in our granite department for a job well done. We're fortunate to have professional craftsmen like Joe employed in our granite fabrication department. By stocking our own granite, owning our own fabrication and installation facility, Mill Creek is able to ensure quality control from start to finish and provide exceptional value to our customers. Customers like Steve and Valerie. Hello guys. Hello. Oh, what a beautiful kitchen. Well, thank you thank so very you. much. We really appreciate it. It yes. turned out lovely. What, what was the uh, biggest thing, maybe the biggest inconvenience about getting granite a week without having to do dishes? Well, we did eat out several times mm -hmm. and uh, we used a lot of plastic uh, silverware and uh, paper plates, but it all turned out, it was well worth it. It turned out lovely. We're very, very thankful, as good as it turned out. Great. Mm -hmm. And now, what's your favorite thing about having this granite? Well, I think the whole aesthetics of the kitchen changed. Um, you know, we did get a new sink, mm -hmm. uh, new uh, fixtures, and uh, it just, it's just lovely. It, the whole character has changed. It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. Well, thank you. Y'all, you made beautiful selections. Well, thank you. And it really fits in with your home, the decor of your home. We, um, you know, with the granite selection that Mill Creek had, uh, it took us several different, um, we picked out several different pieces, and I think we did uh, the best selection that we possibly could. It's a fact that granite in many instances, particularly in a large kitchen, must be seamed. As you saw in the video, our crew takes great care in minimizing those seams. Steve, you had a comment about that. I must say I am more than pleased with the way these seams have came out. They did an excellent job of putting them in. I challenge people when they come and look at the kitchen, say, find me the seam, and they have a very hard time looking at it. It's very smooth. I can't it find it. It blends in perfectly. I mean, it's great. This whole kitchen only has two scenes in it that just really, really came out great. I, I can't even I can't even see them myself and I work with this every day. And now did you get new appliances as well or were uh, these your existing? Well we bought new appliances last year so this was just an ongoing process all the way through um, just to renovate our kitchen and uh, we're just thrilled the way that it turned out. It coordinates beautifully. Well, thank you. You would think you did it all at one time. Oh. <laughs> a lot of people wait till the they get ready to sell their homes put the granite in. We didn't want to wait that long. You know, we, wanted we wanted to, to enjoy, enjoy it, it now. Mm -hmm. So instead of waiting to sell a house, we decided to go ahead and put it in now and use it ourselves. Great choice. And more and more people are making that choice. Now, I'll be remiss if I don't point out that you too made some of your own special touches and additions to the kitchen. One, Tell me about the cabinets. One of the things we did, we took the uh, wall of wood that we had behind us and put in some glass mm -hmm. cabinet doors. Beautiful. And we, and we added some uh, custom Trim. molding around the front edge of it that we thought really made it pop and set out real well. That's a nice touch. I thought that was beautiful. And, and I thought I thought maybe we had done it, but that's, that just shows. <laughs> that just shows, Steve, you all, you all have quite the touch and you're quite a craftsman to do uh, those two extra items. They're beautiful. I would not tackle this by myself. I assure you that. Yeah. You, bring professionals in to do this kind of work. Yeah. Well, the, the collaboration together, a beautiful result. Thank you. Thank you. And thank you again for joining us. Thank you for opening your home. And I'm Ann Murphy with Mill Creek TV. I hope this has been informative and I'll see you next time.